Hello, two heads up. Another skill guide and money making guide here. So let's talk about crafting. Oh my god, how fucking expensive is crafting the level? You don't even have to tell me about it. It is such a pain. Cow hides are over 300 gold each. It's like, how can they be 300 gold each? All I have to do is kill a cow and pick up the hide. How is that worth 300 gold? Well, I believe it's because mainly of the long baking trip it requires uh, to bank the hides. Um, so I'm going to tackle that right now and pre present this little money making slash crafting uh, skill guide to help you all out with uh, getting more hides or getting and not having to pay for hides. So let's talk about crafting guild cows. Hmm, crafting guild cows. Do you even remember that there are cows at the crafting guild? Um, there are. So wait, let's talk about requirements, what you need for this. We're going to ride the hot air balloon to the crafting guild, so you do need to have done the enlightened journey quest and unlocked the route to the crafting guild. You need an oak log and you need a ring of dueling. So let's get started. also recommend wearing lightweight equipment because you don't really need heavy gear to kill cows. So that's why I got the spotty cape on and everything. You don't have much armor on. This really, of course, if you're lo really, really low level, you know, you might need some armor, but I doubt you've done the Enlightened Journey quest at a horrendously low level. So, World 1. Okay, so cowhide. Really, the hard part is just picking up the hides, not killing the cows. Uh oh, that's a dairy cow. Wish I could kill it. Kill these as fast as possible. And I'm in world one, and you, as you can see, there's like no one here. And uh, the best way to do this really is just to kill the cows and pick up the hides uh, later so you make the cows respawn as fast as possible. See, now I can pick up the hides while I'm waiting for cows to respawn. Moo is right. Die, Moo. We got lots of dough, boys. We got lots of dough, boys. Oh, we got lots of dough, boys. And there are even more cows back here, which I totally forgot about. As you can see, I mean, uh, these guys are dropping like nothing. Uh, there's another cow hiding you get in a bit. <clears throat> yeah, this is a uh, pretty decent. And the main thing about this is how short the banking trip is compared to anywhere else where you kill cows. Even unicows, you still have to walk a long ass way back to the bank. Even if you teleport back to Ardome. So even with unicows, if you were just looking for cow hides, you know, for money, not the unicorn horns, then uh this is a good spot to go to, for sure. Yeah, there's a full inventory, so obviously you don't need much explaining to do once you get a full inventory. Teleport back to Castle Wars. bank repeat the process and yep it's as simple as that any you can do this at any level 
and it's a good source of money. I'm not going to tell you how much. I'm just going to tell you uh, if you need to kill cows for money, you'll be <laughs> it'll be plenty of money for you. You'll make a lot, and it'll help you get a cash style stack built. Remember, like cow hides are over 300 each. I think they're like 350 each. So all you need to do is collect 1,000, and you've got 350k. You know, and that's not going to take too long. You'll get a little bit of experience on the way too. And yep, that's all I gotta say about crafting guild cows. Uh, thanks again for watching. Hope this, as always, hope this gave you some good ideas. Uh, really appreciate it if you'd hit that like button and subscribe if you already haven't. Uh, really pumping out channel uh, videos through this channel, and I'm trying to get it up there a bit. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.